Hello guys, I am Kelan Chan and this is the sushi roll the the, the the sushi roll the su the, the suicide roll to Toyo. They see me rolling, they hating, patrolling and trying to catch me riding dirty. So a few things you might want to know before doing this trick is is definitely have your rolls comfortable, dive rolls, um, parkour rolls, all of them rolls, sushi roll, rolls, um, and maybe back handsprings, uh, just to kind of get comfortable jumping with your hands behind you doing a backflip motion. Um, other than that, there's not really much progression to it as far as like other moves you can learn, but there are tons of ways you can work up to it though. So. If you're like me, you throw a huge pad on the ground and you just keep throwing yourself onto your back uh, for about an hour until you figure it out. That's one way you could do it. Or you can actually apply the technique that I'm going to teach you right now that might help you get it a lot faster. And you might not need a pad for this. So, number one rule when learning this trick, you do not have to throw it straight. You can do it off axis, kind of like this, spine behind you, rolling like that. Also, the number one biggest problem is when people try to go through, go for this, especially me my first tries, they like to flip their feet up, and if you bring your feet up, it's going to make it impossible to get that smooth roll down. Kind of like this, and my feet go up, you'll end up flopping just like that and it hurts. <laughs> so wanna, what you want to do is you want to have your hips come out as far as you can and really, really, really try to point your toes straight towards the ground. As you're reaching towards the ground with your hands, you are also going to be pointing to the ground with your toes, kind of like this. <sighs> See that roll? It was a very smooth, very smooth roll. We want very smooth roll. <laughs> Well, that was like reverse. Well, I like that. That was like reverse, man. Mm -hmm. I like that. <laughs> I like that. Just practice doing this a ton, trying to get a nice smooth roll. If you're still struggling jumping into it, try just doing it kind of from like a back bend where you're just here. Maybe resting your head on the ground and then try to kick your legs up and roll forward like that. It might feel really weird. But you try that tons of times, maybe drop one shoulder so you're not going straight over the head at first. Going up and down. Back to the bridge, up and down. Just like that. Yo. <laughs> driving on, guy driving like past in the car, just seeing me hump in the air. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So the easiest way to do this trick is most likely from a crouching position, as low as you can, reaching straight behind you. Remember getting your body, your hips forward, and just catching the ground behind you like this without traveling, just going. That's the easiest way to get smooth. Now if you want to be like other people who get into it going forward, kind of like a gainer, you just kind of run forward a little bit and then shoot it out again and just make sure out of all things you're really reaching behind you so you're not landing head first, and that your toes are still pointing towards the ground so you're not flopping. Like this. Let me do this right. Oh my gosh, this is right. Kinda of like that. What else is there? Oh my gosh, that's pretty much it. <laughs> this is
So there are your tips on the suicide roll. And actually, it's once you get the hang of it and once you actually do a successful one, it is not that scary to do and not that dangerous. It, it, I know it looks really scary. It looks like you're diving straight towards your head, but you're not, especially if you practice doing it off axis at first, just onto the roll where you're spotting over your shoulder. When you actually go for it, you just start really low, kind of like in a crouching position, going like this. And then when you get more comfortable with it, then you can start working yourself up to doing it a lot higher. I'm, I'm not really that comfortable doing it high yet, um, so I stick to staying low, and it's safer too. So I uh, hope you guys enjoy the sushi roll, the, su the, the, the suicide roll tutorial. There you go. You got this.